happening, everybody? You got Brian here, Silver Assassin, Metal Detecting. You got Sean from Brockton, Magna Fisher back there, struggling to do his intro. He's got something going on, SD cards. So I figured I'd hop in here and get something going on. Uh, we're going to come out and do a little bit of beach hunting today, guys. Uh, I was out here last year, did a little bit. Uh, got a Silver Washington from a little bit over there. And um, a lot of old history around here. So we're going to get have some fun. Hopefully get on some stuff. Alright guys, see this one here. Fifty fifty one. Uh it's actually right there under the shell. We're gonna chuck Norris this thing. Yeah. It is an eagle back, but I don't think it's gonna be silver by all of that rust, because otherwise it would just be black. Um Bad 97. All right, you guys are gonna get to watch me epically fail at trying to dig through these rocks with this crappy sand scoop. Oh, did I get it? Now I see a giant freaking rock. Let's see what we got. Like I said, there's a giant rock. Oh, we got us a ring. We got us clad a ring. That is fantastic. And judging how that is brown or black, I apologize. It's probably going to be silver, baby. Ooh. We dig it. Let me, uh, I'll clean it up, see if there's anything inside. You guys can see marked right inside here. I'll put up pictures, but it does say sterling inside there. So that is going to be sterling silver clattering. That's awesome. Right. So there's another mid-40 signal. Could be some more silver. Is why we're here. Down here. And we are looking at dime. Dime that's been toasted and kicked around for a while. Yeah, look at that thing. That thing's done. All of the, uh, the nickel platings off of that thing. That thing's just about to be a copper dime. That thing's been down there forever. Oh, All right, you guys. Were recording that whole thing? I wasn't recording, oh. but now I'm recording, dude, oh. because I didn't. Your video comes out five days before me, so I, I want to give you a hand drop on something, man. Yes. But I didn't want your reaction to be on your video since it comes out. I want your reaction to be on my video. So what we're going to do, buddy, is that we're going to do a hand drop on you. And check this thing here out, buddy. No way. Check that out. What? A clattering? Sterling clattering, baby. Oh, man. That right? is awesome, bro. We got silver here, baby. Oh, man. That's so cool. Right? I love it. That's so, awesome. So this stuff I here, man, that. let's get after it. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> nice little view of the sunset going on out here. I was only planning on coming out for a couple hours. Low tide wasn't until 7.30 tonight, but uh, definitely want to get out, have a little bit of fun, and... um. Come on, look at this scenery. It's absolutely gorgeous out here. All right, guys, this one here, Sean's over there trying to figure something out. Well, I got a screaming 44, 45 over here, so let's see. Let's see, let's see. Well, we got it. We got it. Uh, uh, 
Let's just do that. Let's just dump it out and see what we got. We got us another clad dime. Little jellyfish right there. Not sure if that's uh, I don't know, poisonous or whatever. I wonder how they taste. I'm gonna lick it. All right, guys, we got some helicopters up above head, and I got a 48.52 down below. So let's see what we got. Let's see what we got. We got it out. And same 47. Yeah, I know, one of those weaves that uses a pinpointer in the freaking beach. I'm just not a fan. And that is going to be another green clad dime. Boom. Guys, this is another 47, 48. Probably going to be another clad dime. Forty-nine fifty now, so we're probably going to be looking for a clad quarter. Oh, it's going to be the dime. Another clad dime. All right, guys, this one here, we're looking at a 40, 41 signal. I moved up to the dry. As uh, he said, the, uh, the sun's fading on us. So, I'm going to kind of start working that way. It also does kind of seem like the beach crowd's coming out. The night crowd. Alright, this has gone down now into the 20s, so. You gonna get us a pull tab? Dab. All right, 45, 46 signal. I believe we got it out. And what do we get? Another dime. Tons of dimes here. Gotta dig them all though, because they sound like silver. All right. Sean's GoPro died. He's chasing up. I forget what he said. What'd you say it was? 11-12. An 11-12. Uh, bottle cap. He's got the bottle cap. Fantastic. Figured we'd show it for you guys since he can't. Yep. In the scoop, 16 in the scoop. With the sun going down behind us, it's probably going to be one of the last holes. Come on, baby. 16, 17. What do we got? A mother freaking bottle cap. Again. And ah. welcome to Beach Detecting, my friend. <laughs> uh, this is a 45 single. I'm going to guess a clad dime. Nice. Let me check. What does mine say? Right there. Right there. Clad damage. Nice. It's over here. Nice. It's over there. I thought it was. It's right there, it's right? It sucks. It's right there. No, it's not. It's a rock. What? I'm going to throw it at you. Unbelievable. And there it be. 
Nice. Fresh one. There you go. Nice fresh one. Good to you. Hi everybody, I hope you enjoyed this week's episode. I know I had fun getting out there with Sean from Brockton Magnet Fisher and doing a little bit of beach detecting. Um, going to the beaches really isn't my favorite thing to do, but I was able to get out, get onto a silver ring, so I'm not gonna complain about that. And I'll probably see another couple of beach hunts in the future, I guess, you know? Um, honestly, that gold ring got me motivated for parks and beaches and stuff like that. So yeah, what are you gonna do? And um, Make sure that you catch uh, next week's episode. I just got home, uh, was out with Chris today, and was able to get onto some stuff from the 16 and 1700s. So if you're not yet, make sure you hit that notification bell, subscription, all of that stuff, because uh, got a good one coming next week for you guys. Until then, stay safe, keep it low and slow. Peace.